I am, I am the, the humble, humble seer. seer. Hello and welcome to the humble seer. So we're going to talk Kiki Palmer and her significant other. I do believe she's in a relationship. And um, if not, we'll just we'll just um, talk about her significant other, whomever she's with. But I do believe she's in a relationship. And if not, it's her past or, you know, it's the relationships that she finds herself in. But I feel that she's with someone or was with someone recently. All right. So we're going to pull a card on their overall, how she views him and how he views Kiki. Okay. So the overall is the Knight of Pentacles. And, you know, the Knight of Pentacles, they're young. They're not, you know, the Knight of Pentacles is uh, patient. They're persistent. They're responsible. And what I get is uh, it's more about this significant other that, that she has her child with. This is representative of him. And he is, I'm getting a good guy, a good man. Uh, and he represent, he, he comes in strong in the reading, the Knight of Pentacles, patient, responsible, hardworking, slow moving, but reliable, good father, whether he stays in Kiki's life or not, which I don't see that. I don't see it as a long-term thing, but, um, irrespective, he's coming out in the reading as the very first thing that we see. He's the knight, so he's not the youngest in the suit. There's the, you know, the knight, there's the page, the knight, and then the king. But he comes in and he's doing his best is what I'm getting. I mean, Kiki's got this is what I'm hearing, but that will be an issue down the road. Okay, so how does she view him? She views him as the Six of Cups. And that's the past coming back, fading away, though, really, is what she sees and vanishing. And, you know, fatherhood in, right now is, is tough for, for him, is what I'm getting. And that's why the Six of Cups comes in. You know, it's the Six of Cups, by definition, is the past coming back, fading away, vanishing, hometown, children, good memory, second chance. And I feel like this knight who represents this person in her life, the father of her ch child, uh, he is this knight of pentacles who has issues. And the kind that will pull him away from this relationship frequently and not in the best way. You know, the infidelity and just the pressures of it all <clears throat> as he moves into the forefront. And this is how he views her. The eight of wands, which doesn't surprise me. The eight of wands is messages, it's communication, it's social media, it's fast, quick, you know, just a lot of, of things, <laughs> a lot of, you know, social things that he is not comfortable doing. And he views the relationship in that way. It's the eight of wands. It's, you know, it's just too much coming in too quickly too fast. And it, it moves him away more and more, you know, it moves him away from that relationship. It's like, um, what have I gotten myself into type of thing? What have I done? Why have I done it? Um, you know, what, what is, why is all of this coming down on me is what I'm getting. I just kind of want to do my thing. I just kind of want to be 
me still. I don't want to be in this. Hmm. So that, yeah, that's, that, that's, uh, that is what's happening. And his name is, uh, Darius Jackson. That's who we're talking about here, who is her boyfriend, Darius Jackson. So, yeah, it's going to be some heartbreaks for her, but I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for stopping by the Humble Seer. Do consider liking, sharing, subscribing. Leave a comment below. If you like what I do, buy me a coffee in the description box below. And until next time, you take good care and we'll talk again soon. Bye.